Right. Pleasure doing business with you. Come back. Hello. I'm afraid she's going to be out for a while. She's not well at all. Don't worry, though. I'm sure the rest of Riley's rangers will show up soon and take her home. She had multiple lacerations, contusions, broken leg, some internal bleeding and blunt force trauma. She hasn't been conscious since they brought her in a few days ago. I'd say she tangled with some super mutants and lost. It's a miracle she isn't dead. Oh, very well. I'll do what I can. I just hope her body can withstand the strain. Humans are so fragile. Tamper with that, and we're going to have a problem. This is a harm in using a computer. have I been out? Right. Can't remember what I was doing. Wait! Oh, shit! My men! My team! What happened to them? He's still alive. Look at the strength of They are? Holy shit! Look! Either I need to get out there and lend them a hand, or they aren't going to last much longer. We were mapping the Vernon Square part of the downtown ruins, and got jumped by a super mutant ambush party. Usually it isn't a problem, but this group was bigger than usual. We fought our way into Our Lady of Hope Hospital, hoping to find cover. You got it. More of the ugly bastards just kept coming. We fought our way to the roof and found a way across to the Statesman Hotel next door. The super mutants seemed driven, like they smelled blood. They kept following us. Once in the hotel, the only way to go was up. Very bad move, but we had no choice. On the way, we lost Theo, one of my guys. We were unable to get the ammo case off of his body as we were pushed onwards. So, guns almost dry, we hit the roof of the Statesman. There's so many kinds of traps in mines. I love it. That is pretty much what my character said. Actually, we did lay down a bunch of countermeasures. I don't know how many of them have already gone off, though. When I slipped out with my stealth boy, I think I almost tripped one or two of them. Damn near didn't make it out of there at all, come to think of it. Get the rangers home. Please. That's all I want. I don't care how you do it. That's it for me. Spoken like a merc. You sound like me when I was just a kid starting out in the business. Okay, Hotshot. How about a full suit of Ranger armor? Yes. Yes. It's the best combat armor in the wasteland. Or if that doesn't do it for you, I'll set you up with a minigun from our armory. Either way, you walk away with something. Yes. Whew. I was holding my breath on that one, I think. I wasn't sure what you were going to say. All I ask is that you hurry. I don't know how much longer they will be able to survive up there. I also recommend you try and find the body of Theo, one of my men. He was carrying our main ammo supply. Here, let me punch the ammo box code and some better directions into your pit boy there. All right, thank you. We have a headquarters not far from here. If you can make it there, you're welcome to anything you need inside. Just punch in Riley0247 at the gate. We have ammo, supplies, you name it. Awesome. If I wasn't asking for your help, I'd tell you to stay away. It's thick with super mutants. I don't know why. Butcher, our team medic, has always suspected something's in the area they are looking for or being attracted to. The only place worse I can think of is the mall. 
your best bet is to stay with the Metro Tunnels. Head north from here to Metro Central, then look for the tunnels to the DuPont Circle Station. Exit from the DuPont Circle Station into what we call the Dry Sewers, and eventually you'll wind up in Our Lady of Hope Hospital. Awesome. Not much, I'm afraid. Oh, wait. The hospital may have some supplies that will help you. We saw some storerooms on the way to the right. roof, but didn't have time to raid them. Okay, go ahead. All right. Watch yourself. Those ruins are badass. Very cool. One drop. I think well, I will need repair services. What can I do? You I'm about to go on this journey. Can you paint? Can you repair my jumpsuit, please. Repair my shady hat. It costs one. It costs thirteen. It costs thirty. It costs eighty-three. Seventy-four. All right. Done. What else is here? Huh? Ah! Jesus Christ! Don't don't sneak up on me like that. Last fella, last fella to do that damn near lost my arm. You're new here, yeah. You must be since you're actually talking to talking to me. <laughs> I'm patchwork. They're just patches if you like that. I'm shit. I forget. Who, me? Yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. I guess. No. Yeah. I'll be okay. I just... I just need to try not to lose any more of my parts this time. Sure. And Doc Barrows says that he's... He's getting tired of putting them back on me. So, you know. If you see any, just bring them back. You sure? Some, some people make me hurt myself. Because uh, it makes them laugh. Oh. See you later. <laughs> well, oh, a human. Well, hello. Welcome to Underworld Outfitters. It's, it's been so long since I had a customer. Sure thing, human. Now this is some good stuff. Hmm. A lot of energy cells. And some laser pistols. Scans railway rifle. Huh. Is there a workbench in here? Yes. Do you like bottle cap lines? Sorry, but you know what? Gotta do it. I need those cherry bombs back from uh, the doctor. Hey, Winthrop, how is it going? Unless you have some. You're back. Do you have any cherry bombs? No. Okay, so I gotta get the back from the, uh, the doctor. <sighs> yes, what is it now? I... And then some? Who did I saw him to? And how can we help you? T Long way from the Statesman Hotel. Huh, oh, that's odd. I could have sworn I found some. Good to see you. What do I do with them? What have you heard? We'll accept caps from anyone, even a human. You're back. Um. Oh, 
Otherwise, I'll just sell you the stuff. Trade you for some energy cells and stuff. Give me a shout if you need anything. We got a rocket launcher. Oh, need a conductor. Hmm. You came back. You don't have one. Interesting, because I will need one. Because I know I've been throwing a lot of them away. But I will find one eventually. To my place. Yeah, what is it? Oh, oh my! Someone new. I'm. I'm so sorry. You must think I'm terribly rude. <laughs> welcome, welcome to Carol's place. I'm Carol. It's not much I know, but it's mine. So if you need anything, just let me know. Greta will get you any food you want, and I handle the rooms. It's so good to have someone new here. Even if it is an ugly old smooth skin. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm just kidding. Don't make that face. You'll love it here. Gob? Yes, of course. He's my son. Well, not really. Not like you would think of a son. We ghouls don't really work like that. But I love him like he's my own. Do you know him? Have you seen him? Is he all right? That's... that's terrible. But at least I know he's alive. So that's something. If you get up that way again, tell him that I said I miss him and that I love him. But he shouldn't try to escape. It's too dangerous. No, no, he should stay put where he is. I couldn't bear the thought of him getting hurt. You come back real soon now. Morning, hun. What will it be? Yep. Get it while it's lukewarm. world 